This is arguably the most important night of J.D. Vance's budding political career. With less than two years in the U.S. Senate under his belt, a lot of folks still don't know much about him or what he's bringing to the Republican ticket. At just 39 years old, some I've spoken to here say Vance now seems poised to lead the next generation of the MAGA movement. It's night three of the RNC. The theme, make America strong once again, focusing on national security and America's status on the world stage. Before Pfizer Forum fills up with supporters and delegates from across the country, Vance getting a feel for the stage where he'll be formally introduced as the GOP 2024 vice presidential nominee. Seen here huddling with Donald Trump Jr., Vance now officially part of the former president's inner circle less than four months until election day. Once a fierce Trump critic, Vance now mirrors Trump so much so that some Republicans are starting to see him as Trump's possible successor. And in a way, it looks like it's a pretty clear passing of the torch. You know, if this is, uh, in his opinion, the person who is best suited uh, to take Trumpism, whatever that might be. The MAGA movement. Yeah, and, and, and move it forward. And the Biden campaign agrees, calling Vance a, quote, rubber stamp for Trump's extreme agenda. And make no mistake, J.D. Vance will be loyal only to Trump, not to our country. He supports a national abortion ban and voted against protecting IVF. We're learning Vance and the vice president have spoken. She congratulated him and they agree they should debate, but still have to work out the terms. In Milwaukee, I'm Atrel Nishar.